One of my all-time favorite desserts of all time. Coming right up on the weekend at the cottage. Welcome to Weekend at the Cottage. I'm Nick Manoilovich. It truly is one of our all-time favorite desserts, so often served at the cottage, or especially on weekends, we're making an exceptionally flavored carrot cake with a lemony cream cheese icing to finish. Um, now, this recipe is so amazing. I know you're gonna to wanna to reference the full story at weekendatthecottage.com. You can also watch this video again and again on our dedicated YouTube channel. And then finally, find us on your favorite social media platforms like Pinterest, the Gram, Facebook, and Twitter. Let me show you how to make this fabulous carrot cake. We're going to start by turning the oven on to 350 degrees, rack in the middle position. You're going to need a 9 by 13 pan. You can use a metal pan or a glass casserole as I'm using today. You're just going to grease that pan, set it to the side. All about the carrot, I have six carrots peeled, trimmed. Yes, you can use a box grater, but why when a food processor can help you do the job in record time? When the carrots are grated, you're gonna need two cups for the recipe, but I just wanna say, in case maybe three cups end up in the cake batter, that's okay too. It sure did make my cake taste even better. Let's continue then with the easy part. Watch this. I have one bowl on the work surface. Into that bowl, we're placing two cups unbleached all-purpose flour, one and a half cups granulated sugar, half a cup dark brown sugar packed, half a teaspoon of salt, and one teaspoon of baking soda. Now it's time to spice up this carrot cake. Two teaspoons of ground cinnamon, one teaspoon ground ginger, a quarter teaspoon of ground cloves. The spice profile in this cake is really yummy. We're adding four eggs at room temperature, one cup of vegetable oil. Let's add the three cups, I mean two cups of grated carrots, then half a cup of chopped walnuts. Now we grab a big spoon. We're gonna stir this one bowl wonder of a cake. Make sure everything is well combined before we transfer it into our baking dish. Now we transfer the carrot cake to the oven. We're gonna bake for somewhere between 45 and 50 minutes. You can insert a cake tester just to make sure the center is completely done. Cake comes out of the oven. We're gonna let it cool completely. While it's cooling, let's make a lemon cream cheese icing. Into a smaller glass bowl, eight ounces of cream cheese, four tablespoons of butter. The butter and cream cheese are both at room temperature. Taking a hand mixer, I'm gonna cream those ingredients together. Then we add four cups of icing sugar, one teaspoon pure vanilla extract, bring those ingredients together, and then a really nice flavor enhancement gives it a little bit of tang and zip and zing. How about the juice from half of a lemon? Add that in and then cream your icing until it's nice and fluffy. At about this point, your cake is completely cooled. We're gonna take a palette. I'm just gonna brush the icing in a nice smooth motion across the top of the cake, and it's done. Really, really simple. You can cut it into 12 or 24 pieces. I like a generous size portion. Onto plates, stick a fork on it, and send it off to be enjoyed. Now, I couldn't resist, so I saved a little bit of that cream cheese frosting into a piping bag with a star filter. I took one more carrot, thinly sliced. I have these really funky vegetable cutters, so I cut out little beautiful shaped carrot flowers. I also saved some of the greens from the top of the carrot when I peeled them. So now, at the end, Nick's gonna grab a piping bag, a little tiny rosette. We're gonna tuck a flower in there, and then how about a little bit of carrot green? Of course you can serve this carrot cake super simple, but with a couple little extras, it can go to table fine and fancy. Either way, I know you're gonna enjoy. Uh, in fact, everybody always enjoys this cake. In less than 24 hours, it is completely gone, except for the last little tidbits that I get to enjoy. Maybe this carrot cake with lemony cream cheese icing. It is fabulous. Until next time, enjoy. Mmm, what? Yeah.